actually like hone in on that because I'm yeah. not afraid to fail. Bless, Bless you. you. <laughs> I'm not afraid to fail. I'm not, I, I'm okay with starting something and if it's not working, okay, what's the next thing? Okay, what's the next thing? And I learned, also learned through that, that I'm actually a dope creator. And all we got to do is actually utilize our mind. And we don't need to hear from other people that it's a good idea. Some people may hear your great idea and tell you it's a bad idea because they don't want you to be better than them. And, and also through that, through, because of that, I've learned that you cannot all, you cannot take everyone with you. Yeah. Oh, oh, yes. Even if you want to drag them by their leg with you, but all it's, all it can do is hinder your growth. There's a lot of people out here that want to dim your light. So I've learned to really use my discernment, use my gut intuition. And if I think it's a great idea, I'm going to go and move forward with it. The one thing that I have recently been known for is doing sound baths here in the community. And it was and I actually bought the sound bowls to help my family through the pandemic because it helps with anxiety, stress, overwhelm. And it helped me when I had a mouth stroke in 2016. And because of because of that, I decided to become certified as a sound healer. But I only wanted to I, my goal was really only to help my family. But I decided, hey, you know what? It works for me. Next thing I know, I'm putting them online and they're like, I want to I want to see the sound bowls, too. And just moving with what people are, are looking for. I'm like, you know what? This is actually this is actually going to be a thing. I can make it a thing if it, if, it, if it wants to be a thing. And so I started doing uh, sound baths in a Bodo community garden. I started doing uh, them at schools and, and started doing them for corporate wellness programs. And now I've been able to do sound baths. Proudly say that I've been able to do sound baths for the city of Las Vegas. I've been able to do them for therapy, uh, uh, solutions to change. Uh, been able to do them really all over the city. And I actually became, because of that, I didn't realize that that really what I was doing, I was just doing because I'm not afraid to take any risk. I actually got uh, nominated for and selected for Vegas Top 40 Under 40 because of that. So it's like, thank you. Thank you. So, so for me, I would say if I could give any advice to any, any of you ladies in here is don't be afraid to take the risk. Don't and also don't be afraid to shift if you need to shift. 